Hello everybody, it is me, Ray Bear Productions, and today we're going to be reviewing, or no, not reviewing, but seeing how much my Funko Pops are worth. Um, yeah, if you're new to the channel, like and subscribe, I'm gonna probably do some more Funko Pop videos like this. So, okay, I guess, if this pop video, if the, these types of videos start to get popular, I'll do more. Alright, first off... Let's start off with, um, whoa, one of my Fortnite ones right here, um, Dark Voyager, he is worth about, hold on, let me look it up here, so, oh, I looked through all the Amazon listings, er, and the eBay listings and stuff, and it just says, it's just worth the retail price, so, it's not really that rare. Alright, time for the next Funko Pop. The next Funko Pop is... Um, let's do... This one. So, this one right here is based off of a meme. It's really old. Um, I happened to come across it, then I just wanted to buy it, so... Yeah. And let's see how much he's worth. He is worth about um retail price. So yeah. This is how much he is worth. Not worth that much, but the next one is gonna be Cuphead one. This one is King Dice right here. So exclusives or comments this is a common king dice i don't know he's probably not worth that much let's look at it up anyway so normally all right let's look at this up so amazon let's do that oh 50 dollars 18 left in stock oh wow so he is like 50 dollars right there oh wow $36 on eBay, or yeah, eBay, I guess. Then, this one's a golden one. We want the original one. Um, yeah, so those two listings are the only one that I can find. Yeah, he, he's, he's a lot of money. That's a lot of money for a common or a com I thought he was a common I guess not alright up to the next one so next one is a fortnite one too last fortnite one omega um he looks like he's not gonna be worth that much um I got him a few years ago boxes in good condition Oh, wow, there's a lot. There's a lot on the back. I have this one and Omega, which is he's on here. Other than that, that's literally all I have. There is a lot on the back. I've seen way more Funko Pops. Um, wow, they made a lot of Fortnite Funko Pops. So let's look up how many, how, how much money he's worth. Look at multiple of them, and it looks like he is a common as well he's like mostly like ten dollars on like every single listing so like re he's retail price so if you want him he's probably at walmart or myers or something wherever you get your stuff all right next one go pop all right this one is a rick and morty one the only rick and morty one i had perch suit rick um i had him like a year got him like a year ago so he's probably not worth that much uh, I really love Snowball. I like how it looks. I like that one. Yeah, let's see how much he's worth. Look at a bunch of listings as well, and it looks like he is worth retail price as well, so. He isn't worth that much. 
So, he's probably at your Walmart or something. So, if you want to go get him, sure. Or you can just buy him on Amazon. So, he's in stock. Alright, next one, go Bob. Okay, so this one is a Cuphead one. I got him, I got this guy like 2018, 2017. He's a Walmart exclusive. Um, there's all the not exclusive characters on the back. Oh, yeah, that. There's um, some, a bunch of dents in here. Probably because I, I, was, I, I remember to get him in and out of the box a lot. So, he is like in fair condition. Because, yeah. He's like not in really good condition, but he is. It's, he's like in the middle. He's in decent condition. And he still has his box. It's worth. Like, I don't know. That's what we're gonna find out right now. Alright. Well, right here is the cheapest I could find him for. So, on eBay, he is. The cheapest I could find him for is like $60. Yeah, that's pretty rare. And on Walmart, he's like 80 or something dollars. So, yeah. He is. He is a vaulted Funko Pop now, so. I guess you can't get him no more. You waste your $60 on a Cuphead Funko Pop, I guess. I mean, I have it, so. I don't know what to say anymore. Okay, next Funko Pop. This Funko Pop right here, I got him in 2018 or 2017. I see a bunch of people with the blue eyed one. And, but I have a yellow eyed one, so I don't the blue one is a painting mistake i don't know and his box is in like really good condition i don't see any cracks or, or like dents or anything only like right here there that's the only dent i see so yeah he's in pro probably like almost mint condition and also it's still square right here and like his box is really clean if you can see here so only, you can only see that here right there if you can see it you have really good eyes um all right let's look up how much he's worth the ones that i see with the blue eyed ones i think it's a normal one so the blue eyed one go for a retail price this one i yeah it has green eyes mine has a green eyed box but you see like yellow eyes so that one goes for like the same exact price. Um. Oh, this one's a Chase one. He's Sepia. He goes. Oh wow, that's a lot of money. Um. Trying to find a yellow-eyed one here. Yep, right here. He goes for retail price, so like fifteen dollars. Yeah, so if you want one, check out this eBay listing I found. Um find it i'm too lazy to put it in the description anyways i just put hashtags in there so it gets views so yeah okay on to the second to last funko pop this one right here i think i got for like 15 dollars um on mercari like a year ago this guy is nightmare cupcake he was only at target this guy is pretty old because it has the fnaf 2 hallway and it has all the nightmares Cupcake, he's he is not that rare, I'm pretty sure. So I'm pretty sure you can get him for a cheap price on eBay, but they do not sell them in stores. This one they don't they I'm I'm sure I'm 100% sure they do not sell them in stores anymore. So don't even try looking at your target to find a nightmare cupcake. That guy I'm pretty sure got vaulted. Like, I don't know. Overpriced, let's see eBay. Oh wow, wow, that one's a hundred dollars more than I bought him. 
Wow. Okay, this one. Don't eat. Don't eat. Don't buy that one. That one's just. That one's just stupid. No. That that one's just screaming. Fake. Midnight Mystery Warrior. No. That's not FNAF at all. And it doesn't even say, say no. Just it sucks. It sucks. Okay, this one eBay. Wow, forty dollars. That one's YouTube. Thirty-five dollars. Sixty-six dollars with a pop, pop protector. Um, twenty pounds. I'm not. I'm, I don't live in the UK. I don't have the plushie though. It'd be cool to have the plushie. It'd be cool. I have the normal cupcake plushie, but I don't have the cupcake. Okay, um, that was all I could see. Yeah, he is pretty expensive. I bought him a year ago on Mercari for like fifteen dollars. Now on on like Amazon, he's cheaper than you could probably get him on eBay. That eBay listing right here, and then. It's probably the cheapest you can get him. Let me try to find that listing again. Right here. It's $36. $35? Yeah. So. Alright. On to the last one. Okay, so the last one is pretty special. I have, an, I have him in a pop case. Um, this one is a Funtime Freddy. I did a review on him, like, last time. But I got him signed. That's my real name. <gasps> Oh my gosh, name revealed. Real. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, um. And then there's. You can't really see it because it's gold, but it says Cullen Goff right there. I'm pretty sure that's Funtime Freddy. Then he's a limited edition Chase. Um. Open faceplate one. This one is a vaulted Funko Pop right here. So. He is. Like. I bought him for like fifty dollars like a few weeks ago. Then I got him signed, so I don't know how much he's worth. So I'm guessing, yeah, I'm just. I already know how much he's worth normally. He's like fifty dollars worth normally. Um, he is Funtime Freddy. Um, there's the rest of the cast. And then, there. Alright, let's see how much he's worth now. Signed. I got a listing right here. And, oh wow, $325 for normal Funtime Freddy signed. Alright, let let's go to my calculator. Hold on, I'll pause this. Okay, so, I got the calculator pulled up right here. Okay, so $325 plus Wow, so he is worth around $375. Wow, you could buy like almost three Shadow Freddy plushies with that. That's a lot of money. So, or probably he could be worth even more. I don't know. Yeah, so, it even has my name on it, so I don't, it, that could increase it, decrease it, I don't know. So, yeah. Okay, um, ignore the percent icon, but this is how much this, uh, Funko, my Funko Pop collection is worth. Um, ignore the percent thing, by the way, but, um, yeah, this is how much it's worth, uh, $545. I, the signature for Funtime Freddy added a lot. It added, like, $200, so... Without him, it'd be like two hundred do two hundred something dollars, two hundred or one hundred something dollars. That's still a lot of money. But this, this is a lot of money. All right, so that that this is how much my Funko Pop collection is worth. Um, all right, so like and subscribe, turn on notifications, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.